and people ask you how you are or how you're doing and I just, you know, I'm like, I'm fine. <laughs> but um, it definitely, you know, wears on you, I think. My name is Linda Huang and I am a social media strategist and blogger and also the co-founder of Stop Race Based Hate. They basically told me if I didn't stop talking about the Freedom Convoy then they would remove my fingers um, so that I wouldn't be able to write about it or post about it. Oh, that's so awful. You're an absolute idiot joke on a bowl of bad flavored pho. Like, who writes these things? Who... There's like a sense of like maliciousness that's underneath there that actually needs to be taken very serious. I was basically calling them out on racism and I was asking others to do the same. And from that, I think was like the worst few weeks of my life. I blocked thousands of people. When people t from a marginalized group tell you this is something that's happening, believe them. Dumb Chinese Yeah, that one, that one's scarier, you know. Uh, there's a lot of scary misogyny, violence. They're saying all these things, all these racist things, all these very dangerous, uh, harassing things, because they think there's anonymity. But if they're no longer anonymous, then, then I think people would think twice. There are people out there who, um, who unfortunately are very hateful and, and, could, and could actually, you know, and hurt people because of what they look like or, or you know, how they talk. And that's not okay.